Have you ever wondered if the advanced AI systems we use daily could pose ethical dilemmas? As we stand on the precipice of the 21st century, the rapid advancement of AI technology is undeniable. From the AI-powered personal assistants that make our lives easier, to the autonomous vehicles that aim to revolutionize transportation, to the recommendation algorithms that curate our online experiences, artificial intelligence is becoming an increasingly ubiquitous part of our daily lives. But with this rise of AI comes a new set of ethical dilemmas. How do we ensure that these systems respect our privacy, our rights, and our individuality? How do we navigate the murky waters of AI bias, or the potential misuse of these powerful technologies? These are not just hypothetical questions, but real issues that we face as we continue to integrate AI into our society. As AI continues to evolve, so does the complexity of the ethical questions it raises. Consider the case of autonomous vehicles where the AI must make split-second decisions. Imagine you're in a self-driving car cruising along a highway. Suddenly, a group of pedestrians erratically steps onto the road. The car has two options, hit the pedestrians or swerve and hit a concrete wall. Either way, there's a potential for loss of life. Who should the car be programmed to protect, the passengers or the pedestrians? This is a modern variation of a classic thought experiment in ethics, known as the trolley problem. In its original form, a runaway trolley is headed towards five people tied to the tracks. You can divert the trolley onto a different track, but there's one person tied there. Do you intervene, effectively choosing to kill one person to save five? Translating this to autonomous vehicles, the question becomes, how do we program AI to make such life or death decisions? Should the car's primary duty be to protect its passengers at all costs? or should it strive to minimize overall harm, even if that means endangering its passengers? The trolley problem is a thorny issue because there's no universally accepted answer. It's a question of ethics, of values. Do we value the many over the few, the passengers over the pedestrians? It's a decision that could mean life or death, and it's one that autonomous vehicles could be forced to make in a fraction of a second. Moreover, this dilemma raises questions about accountability. If an autonomous vehicle makes a decision that results in harm, who is responsible? The car's manufacturer, the software developer, or the car itself? These questions highlight the ethical implications of programming decisions into AI. It's not just about creating technology that can drive a car. It's about defining the principles that guide this technology, the ethical framework within which it operates. So, as we step into this brave new world of autonomous vehicles, we're not just passengers on a journey of technological advancement, we're also travelers on a road of ethical exploration, grappling with questions that challenge our deepest values. Can we trust an AI with a decision that could mean life or death? Another disconcerting example of AI's ethical implications is the creation of deepfakes. Imagine this. A video of a celebrity or political figure convincingly saying or doing something they never did. This is the reality of deepfakes, a technology that leverages artificial intelligence to create hyper-realistic fake videos. Here's how they're made. Deepfakes use a type of AI known as deep learning, which is where they get their name. They work by feeding an algorithm thousands of images of a person allowing the algorithm to learn their features. The more images you feed it, the more accurate the deepfake becomes. Once the learning phase is complete, the AI can then recreate the person's face in any video effectively putting words into their mouth. But as you can imagine, this technology's potential for misuse is immense. Deep fakes can be used to spread misinformation, tricking people into believing things that aren't true. They can damage reputations, making people appear to say or do things they never did. And in the realm of politics, deep fakes have the potential for sabotage, altering the course of elections by spreading false narratives about candidates. The ethical quandaries of deep fakes are profound. On one hand, the technology is a testament to how far AI has come. It's an incredible display of innovation and ingenuity. But on the other hand, it's a potential weapon for those wishing to deceive, manipulate, and harm. It's a classic dilemma of technology and ethics. Just because we can, does it mean we should? As we further advance into the age of AI, we must grapple with these questions. We must consider the potential harm and misuse of technologies like deepfakes, and develop safeguards and regulations to prevent such misuse. Deepfakes raise the question, just because we can do something with AI does it mean we should? Predictive policing is another area where AI's ethical implications are in the spotlight. This concept which seems straight out of a science fiction novel is becoming increasingly prevalent in the real world. 
But what exactly is predictive policing? In its simplest form, predictive policing uses artificial intelligence to analyze vast amounts of data and predict potential criminal activity before it happens. This can range from identifying areas with high crime rates to pinpointing individuals who might be more likely to commit a crime. But while this technology may sound promising in theory, it's not without its problems. One of the biggest concerns is the potential for bias in these systems. After all, a predictive model is only as good as the data it's trained on. If the data reflects societal biases such as racial or economic disparities, the AI could end up reinforcing these biases rather than eliminating them. This means that certain groups could be unfairly targeted by predictive policing, leading to a cycle of discrimination and mistrust. And it's not just a theoretical concern. There have been several instances where predictive policing systems have been found to disproportionately target minority communities. Then there's the issue of privacy. With predictive policing, law enforcement agencies could potentially have access to a vast amount of personal data. This raises questions about how this data is collected, who has access to it, and how it's used. The line between protecting public safety and infringing on personal privacy can be uncomfortably thin. In the end, predictive policing represents a double-edged sword. On one hand, it holds the potential to make our communities safer. On the other, it risks perpetuating societal biases and infringing on our privacy. As with many aspects of artificial intelligence, the ethical implications are complex and multifaceted. Predictive policing exposes the ethical dilemma of sacrificing personal privacy for perceived safety. As we continue to navigate the murky waters of AI ethics, it's crucial that we keep these dilemmas in mind and strive for solutions that balance the benefits of technology with the need to protect our fundamental rights. With these ethical dilemmas in mind, who bears the responsibility? It's a question worth pondering. As we grapple with the ethical challenges brought about by artificial intelligence, the spotlight inevitably falls on the tech companies. These are the entities shaping our AI-driven future, and it's only fair that they shoulder a significant chunk of the responsibility. Tech companies play a crucial role in ensuring that AI development and deployment is carried out ethically. They're the ones at the wheel, steering the course of AI technology. But with great power comes great responsibility. They must ensure that the technology they create is used for the betterment of society, and not to its detriment. This is where regulations come into play. Regulations aren't just a set of rules to follow. They're a roadmap, helping guide tech companies along the path of ethical AI development. By adhering to regulations, tech companies can ensure that their AI technologies are developed and used in a manner that is ethically sound and socially beneficial, but regulations alone aren't enough. Transparency is just as crucial. Tech companies need to be open about their AI development processes. They need to let the public in to understand how their AI systems work, how they make decisions, and what measures are in place to prevent misuse. This transparency fosters trust, and trust is a vital component in the relationship between tech companies and society. Lastly, there's accountability. Tech companies must be held accountable for their AI technologies. If an AI system causes harm or behaves unethically, the company behind it should be held responsible. Accountability ensures that tech companies don't just pay lip service to ethical AI development, but truly commit to it. All these, regulations, transparency, and accountability, are tools that can help tech companies navigate the complex ethical landscape of AI. They're not foolproof, but they're a start. Tech companies must navigate these ethical waters with care, understanding the immense responsibility they hold. As we move forward into an increasingly AI-driven world, the ethical questions surrounding AI are more important than ever. We've traversed the landscape of autonomous vehicles, deepfakes, predictive policing, and the responsibility of tech companies. Each of these facets presents its own ethical quandaries that need to be addressed. Autonomous vehicles must prioritize safety, while deepfakes threaten our abilities to discern truth from fiction. Predictive policing can lead to profiling, and tech companies must shoulder the responsibility of using AI ethically. As we've seen, these issues are not just theoretical, but have real-world implications that can affect us all. The onus is on us, as a society, to ensure that we are not just developing AI for the sake of advancement, but also considering the ethical implications of these developments. We must use AI responsibly and ensure that it is used to enhance our lives, not to harm or deceive. The future of AI is not just about technological advancement but also about ethical evolution.